Hello guys, welcome back to our channel. We're gonna do a year and a half of using this smart watch, the Samsung Gear S with the SIM card and the uh, uh, pulse sensing sensor and the UV sensor, all kind of sensors uh, mounted inside. The first impression, it's a good watch. It's a smart watch. It doesn't have so many applications and uh, you got to install it only by your phone in this case i have no free i love this phone here in uh, samsung galaxy application you will install the application for those of you who see this watch for the first time but the watch is on the market somewhere approximately two years uh, since his uh, launch samsung even has two models uh, beside this one that are newer I want to say, I think in total uh, has five or six smartwatches. Anyway, uh, the S help is working. You got to make three measures for one uh, to make an opinion, a good opinion. I don't use the pendometer and I don't recommend you to use this because you will lose battery life. This uh, watch's battery life, with it could last two, three or four days without bluetooth only only for watch only for displaying time yeah you know four days it's uh i think it's great yeah for a for a smart watch for 316 uh, milliamps uh, the battery life it's good it's not great but it's good uh, i saw a lot of guys that uh, don't close their data so in uh, for example in mobile networks in mobile networks here if you activate it or the Wi-Fi the clock will discharge rapidly and this is a, the same thing it's with the GPS location for um, for those of you who like this watch for running this deactivate the GPS because the GPS uses a lot of battery okay um, and the applications what i like is babysitting the babysitting is great because you can activate it uh, this babysitting application and with your screen turned off you can view and listen with uh, with your baby say i have i say i have image and the, my uh, screen of the phone is turned off and I have image for a couple of seconds the producer and yes this is playable when uh, the phone hears the sound and here's my voice talking it will uh, you see the red flashes is like your baby's cry and uh, it will announce you on the watch you can use it as a monitor as a baby monitor is great okay pause and with uh, you have also something uh, you can put music on the phone here is the phone and you can put on the phone to make your baby sleep faster okay another application that I like and I install it I install it all the Samsung the timer the stopwatch the voice memo being a few applications Samsung made this uh not already default in the watch but you have to install it uh, find my car i didn't uh, i didn't use it at all and um, if we're talking about find my car it uses gps the gps on this watch it's a rubbish you got to stay minutes tens of minutes even for in the clear sky for this watch to get some some satellites and uh working for example i use it at the s half at the running and i got to stay i begin to run 10 minutes and still the uh, gps doesn't doesn't respond doesn't uh, put me on the map that i'm running you got to activate it from here location is turned off when you turn on it asks you to enable your GPS I already showed you 
okay this is the big disadvantage for this clock i don't know if samsung will make a better firmware come on let's be reasonable we are outside at clear skies and you have to wait that many minutes okay the s voice is that not that accurate uh, what you will use um, i i don't like that is you will not find shazam for example or power amp yeah you know i'm looking for an equalizer for for this watch a player with equalizer i didn't seem to find the default player is good uh, but doesn't have that equalizer <laughs> the blackjack it's a fun game and the ebay for uh, gear it will announce you if your package or you have some notifications well if your package will uh, is uh, shipped some news we ha you have the navigator the navigator is a uh, rubbish uh, you have you can store a map f by default but uh, i didn't seem to manage to get this thing working without a phone so for example i'm activating my gps um, from the watch and uh, it wants me to connect it to the phone to find my location this is garbage uh, this application you know if you don't want to uh, it's made for if you don't want to stay with your phone in the hands you can put here the let's see i don't know if i have it installed uh, this navigator and uh, send the map to the watch and the watch will give you direction at your hand mm, it's not that useful okay the quick settings i use it for example for monitoring my baby and uh, uh, quick settings you could turn your data on on the phone see it turns my data internet data or you could put where is it i think here yes you can put your phone uh, in mute you can do all kinds of things open the wifi turn off the bluetooth even uh, turn on the location this is also an interesting that i will use it i didn't use it but it look interesting for example if you will do push-ups this application it's some kind of useful i will begin to use it i want to be honest and i didn't use it but it looks good if you are for example if you want to do push-ups every day and uh, it will make statistics in the exterior as the design the watch is good some kind of good if you see here i cleaned it up but the dust and the filth will uh, get stuck on let me show you on the on the watch so uh, you got to clean it up very frequently the rubber didn't uh, break or snapped this is a good thing um, but i had a problem and this is a big big problem for all gears for example what's my point this is the back the original back this is the new original that i ordered so guys please don't make a laugh <laughs> out of out of me because the original and i want to explain what i've done here the original charger this is the original more heavier with a uh, with a with a battery inside and the original charger these pins are very very hard so i don't know the why the producer did these hard pins but if you see here it's a pin that is not intact the same thing did with this pin so i tried to put some solder here and make uh, some kind of contact don't make fun of me i just tried because uh my watch my smart watch didn't seem to be charged at all with the original or i bought it uh ebay charger in five dollars but immediately th this is a garbage for thought from samsung i don't know how uh, these practical guys from the development uh, made the idea to charge your watch in these clips these clips are breaking easily so 
this eBay charger was uh, not that good. This original charger I made so melt to plastic here just to make it uh, to work just a little bit. Okay, so uh, we got a we got a tutorial that will show you how to change your back side or your or your back panel. This is the entire panel of uh, of your watch. It's not with voice, but it's very clear. It will show you how to change how to change this frame, this nice frame, and uh, be careful to take out from the old the speaker before you definitely mount back the watch. The SIM card is working great. Uh, you, it uh, immediately connects to the network. Uh, a couple of times it loses the network, but it didn't repeat. This is important. Uh, this new panel, when I put the receiver, it's not like this. It's not like... Uh, like this box it's smaller and the sound is weaker now the sensor is working the fridge the bluetooth all kind of stuff the watch is like new but the sound it's weaker from the speaker see the tutorial will put a link and you can make an opinion sometimes i see that uh, samsung will do an update uh, update to this this smartwatch but I don't see that much improvements in in the Samsung updates so that's all so I'm looking for that update that will uh, you know improve the GPS come on guys come on Samsung improve your watches and do the best if you want to make forwarding the calls you got to have it's not an app it's a widget it's called easy redirect and this easy redirect you will put the install the widget give the number to easy redirect and uh, it will forward all your calls on gears uh, in my country i have some kind of problem on the prepay I have to be on uh, the carrier just to forward my call. So if your call forwarding is not working, be be attention to this aspect. As a underwater thing, it doesn't break. We I take it to a pulse. Uh, we had a review for this watch. It's underwater. It will stay underwater maximum at 1.5 meters, no more than 30 minutes. So don't dive it more than 40 minutes at maximum 1.5 meters uh, the watch uh, has some problems and on these holes this is the microphone and this is the speaker and the water will be infiltrated inside them so with a good blow uh, if you have a blower for photography or if you have you can blow it with your uh, mouth uh, blow it or use a hair dryer in time it will uh, That water inside the holes will be dry out and the water didn't uh, didn't um, Infiltrate in the watch not even once I Didn't have problems for this uh, in this aspect One uh, interesting Think I want to move if you uh, don't know what you're doing on your sleep you can monitor your turns on the bed it records sleep data you know uh, I'm wondering what will what Samsung will do with this information with this data for the clock you have a lot of skins I personally like this default skin it's very elegant and very useful with a lot of information now the price is very low from the 400 dollars uh, we pay on the launch this watch is now 200 it's at a half you can uh, you can uh, buy yourself a great smart watch and even it has two years it's still um, a leader I, I and i got to tell you something uh, interesting apple 
on some websites I found that Apple uh, is dominating uh, the the smart watch the smart watches on the market with what so Apple smart watch doesn't have uh, keyboards for example I want to write a message and for example I can text with the watch being connected by Bluetooth or forwarding it will send a message from the watch Apple didn't make their watches underwater uh, and has a lot of cons they don't have this technology so how the hell uh, they get this name of being the greatest watch and dominate the market uh, the, the smart watches market with what also the great aspect that uh, apple watches don't have 3g or 4g doesn't don't have sim card so what the hell apple what the hell that uh, writers of the website they don't know what they are talking about just because it looks small good you can use a uh, doxa or um, uh, or Rolex or uh, Timex or uh, I don't know a good brand for a classic uh, watch at your hand a smart watch got to be incorporated a lot of features inside so I don't know where that uh, iPhone guys that Apple guys made the domination on the market come on let's be reasonable Okay, uh, despite all this, um, something was, uh, I, I seem uh, a lot of people that change their TZN to Android. It is possible, you will see a lot of tutorials that will teach you this, but it's a catch. Uh, they didn't, uh, the developers, they didn't uh, make a good firmware to preserve the battery with this and the application are optimized. In that on Android, I think 5.1.1 are that not that optimized, and the battery life is very short. It will consume battery life, and I seen uh, at the Bluetooth a lot of bugs. Yes, it been great if this watch had Android because it, there are lots of application for Android, but are not that optimized application. It will consume your battery immediately, so you don't want that. Um, it's a watch. If you want to navigate on the internet, you will not navigate in your watch. If, for example, if you are uh, in the summer, uh, somewhere only with your watch and you want to see an information very quick, yes, Opera Mini, it's great. But uh, to surf the internet is not that uh, pleasurable. Okay, uh, this is the review, guys. I hope you like it and uh, I hope I give you essential and good information. For you to make an opinion, how is this watch after uh, one and a half years of using it? Just subscribe to our channel, thumbs up and have a great day. See you, bye!